And thus you find yourself in a dark place. One of the reasons why is because you have failed to give yourself the mental exercises that you need on a daily basis. It's no different than a person that gains a lot of weight. They fail to eat right and they fail to exercise. Mentally, sometimes we find ourselves beaten, battered, broken, and bruised because we are not practicing mental calisthenics. We're not putting our mental health first, our mental fitness first. So I need you to realize you're not the only one going through what you're going through. You're not the only one to be down and out from time to time. You're not the only one to feel inferior. You're not the only one to feel inadequate. But you can choose to make a change. You can choose to win those daily battles with darkness. You can choose to win those daily battles with your inner demons. You can choose to win those daily battles with the outer drama, the outer problems, the outer situations that develop and arise. Not only from you, but those that you are hanging around. Sometimes you gotta simply shut down all the outside noise, shut down those that are closest to you by simply saying, I understand that mental health is wealth. And thus, from this very moment on, I am exercising my option to remove you from my life. See, mental fitness is a priority. But for far too long, you have not let it be a priority into your life and it's coming back to bite you. This is the moment in time that all that changes. It all starts with you. And like Trent Shelton says, you have to protect your peace. You have to protect your inner peace. So you gotta wake up in the morning and you gotta figure out what works best for you. Some people do yoga, some people meditate. For me, I like to get up and I like to spread some positive energy to the world. So I get on my phone and I send a whole bunch of positive things out via social media. Then I exercise, then I eat something healthy. What is it for you? You have to figure out how to start your mental day off correct. If you gotta get up early for work, what do you need to do to get your mind right before you go? Because that's super important. Mental fitness exercises. I love this quote. It says, your fitness is 100% mental. Your body won't go where your mind doesn't push it. Stop allowing your mind to feed your body negative nutrition because you get out of it what you put into it. And if you keep feeding yourself that negative nutrition, guess what's gonna happen? You're gonna be bloated on negativity. You're gonna be bloated on ignorance. You're gonna be bloated on drama. And the only way for you to overcome that is those mental fitness exercises and inhaling and digesting positive nutrition. You have the power to do that. So let me give you a few mental fitness exercise tips. Number one, take some time for you. Sometimes you gotta be like, blah, give me 10 minutes. Blah, give me 20 minutes. And don't feel bad about it. Take that time to enjoy your inner peace and become one within yourself. Number two, you gotta ask yourself the tough questions. And in this scenario, there is an opportunity for you to make a decision. And if you ask yourself the tough questions before you react, nine times out of 10, you're gonna get a positive result. But if you just react and emotionally respond, you're gonna look up and you're gonna be down in the dumps. So we gotta think, is this something that I can control? In the bigger scheme of my life, is this really that important? Because most things that tear us down are not even that important in the bigger scheme of our life. So ask yourself the tough questions. Take a few seconds before you react. Number three, understand the rules of life. Sometimes we're out here playing a game that goes in direct conflict to living a successful, mentally peaceful and stable life. So make sure you understand that if I do this, I'm setting myself up for this result. And is that the result that you want? Mental fitness exercises. Also, figure out what works best for you. And if it doesn't work best for somebody else, tough. 
take care of you first. Put your mask on first, then you can help other people. Love you some you, and that way you can love other people way more effectively. Never forget, to obtain mental wealth, make sure you're depositing daily positive energy, and also have love for yourself. And once you do that, you will find yourself climbing over that hump and making each and every day of your life a Wednesday. And just when you get tired and don't think you have no more left, give yourself one more, give yourself two more. Mental fitness exercises. This is a great day to win. Let's go.